For more videos visit for the sake of education.com. Alright guys, now we're gonna do this problem in which I want you to find the resultant couple moment acting on this whole plate. I, you gotta treat this whole plate as a, as a one body and you just gotta pick any arbitrary point and calculate the moments about it. So I'm gonna pick A right here. Let me pick this moment. So by picking this point, this one and this one create no moment. So I got one, two, three, four forces creating moments. So let's say that counterclockwise is positive. So the moment about A is equal to first you got this moment of 150 pounds and you got to multiply by the distance of the arm which is 4 feet that's 4 feet the second one is this one 300 which is turning an arm right here to find this one right here you know that this hypotenuse is uh, 4 feet you know that this is 4 feet and you know and you know that uh, if these three distances are all the same, these three angles are all the same. If these three angles are all the same, you know that the the sum of the angles of the inside of a triangle add up to 180. So 180 divided by 3 is 60, 60, and 60. If this is 60, this is 30. If this is 30, this length right here is given by 4 sine of 30 so that will be plus you got this 300 force times 4 sine of 30 which is 2 then we got this force turning this lever arm which is Three hundred times two again, and last but not least, we got this two hundred turning this four feet lever arm, which is four. So when you add this together, you're gonna get that this is equal to twenty six hundred foot pounds. Final answer. They all go the same direction as you can see. So this lever arm will be turned kind of clockwise this lever arm will be turned clockwise this force turns this lever arm um, kind of clockwise they all go kind of clockwise and this one turns it kind of clockwise so as you can see this thing is going to be turning the whole thing kind of clockwise please comment below if you want me to do any problems and i'll be happy to help thank you